It's 11 trivia questions on famous colleges and universities. Study up, because we've got questions coming at you. This is Trivia with Buds. What it be and welcome to another episode of the Trivia with Buds podcast. I'm your host, Ryan Buds. Thank you guys so much for checking out the show and thanks for hitting subscribe so you never miss a new episode. Speaking of things you should never miss, you should go follow my friend Dan Polydorus, aka Death by Toys, on Instagram. That's Death by Toys on Instagram. He's got, I think, over a hundred thousand followers, and he makes amazing custom toys. I'm holding one in my hand. We just gave away at one of my trivia nights. It's called the Burning Bush Playset. It's a little bush, and it includes a match. It's a nice little biblical uh, playset. It looks like a real action figure. It's hilarious. It comes with a death certificate of authenticity from Dan Polydorus and a stick. Sticker that says death by toys so uh, go check him out he also just did in record time the fly that landed on mike pence's head during the vice presidential debate uh he made the fly as an action figure <laughs> with like like within an hour of it happening so uh if you love stuff like that if you love satire if you love crazy creations death by toys on instagram real good friend of mine dan Polly doris all right today's episode is about colleges and universities just did a show for my alma mater uh, which is Western Illinois University in Macomb, Illinois. Where's Macomb, Illinois? It's right next to Mabrush, Illinois. That's the lamest joke I learned going to school there. And here come 11 questions for you on colleges and universities. All right, guys, here we go with college and university trivia. Question number one, Veritas, meaning truth, is the motto in which university? Considered the oldest institution of higher learning in the U.S. Veritas, meaning truth, is the motto of which university? Considered the oldest institution of higher learning in the U.S. Question number one. And question number two, Jeff Bezos and Michelle Obama both attended which of these New Jersey institutions? Was it Princeton, Monmouth, Rutgers, or Seton Hall University? Question number three, the phrase alma mater comes from the Latin meaning nurturing mother. What does alumnus mean in Latin? What does alumnus mean in Latin? Alma mater means nurturing mother. What does alumnus mean? And question number four, the University of Bologna, the oldest university in the world, was founded in 1088 in what country? University of Bologna, or Bologna, as it's spelled. Question number five, what private research university in North Carolina was founded in 1838 in the town of Trinity and then moved to its current location in Durham in 1892? What private research university in North Carolina is that? Going into the second half of our quiz here on colleges and universities, number six, the Seven Sisters are seven highly selective women's liberal arts colleges in the northeastern United States. Which of these is the largest? Is it Smith College, uh, Barnard College, Bryn Mawr College, or Vassar College? Which one is the largest? And number seven, the Rhodes Scholarship is an international postgraduate award for students to study at which famous university? The Rhodes Scholarship, which university? Question number eight, over the course of several decades, what Maryland University has led all U.S. universities in annual research expenditures? Over the course of several decades, what Maryland University has led all U.S. universities in annual research expenditures? And number nine, Morehouse College is a private, historically black men's college in Atlanta, Georgia. Which of these Hollywood actors was expelled from Morehouse for student activism? Was it Denzel Washington, Spike Lee, Wesley Snipes, or Samuel L. Jackson? Question number 10, the NACDA, N-A-C-D-A, Director's Cup, is an award given to the American college or university with the most success in collegiate athletics. Between 1994 and 2019, which institution won every year? Question 
And number 11, the two-point bonus question at the end of this round. The town where Massachusetts Institute of Technology is located shares its name with what British university, the second oldest in the English-speaking world? Second oldest in the English-speaking world. What university name is that? Those are all your questions for colleges and universities. Thanks for listening. We'll be right back in just a second with the answers. We're back with the answers to college and university trivia. Let's see how you did. Let's see if you graduated this episode. Number one, Veritas, meaning truth, is the motto of which university considered the oldest institution of higher learning in the U.S.? That's Harvard University. Number one, Harvard I believe they have the biggest library in the world, too. Number two, Jeff Bezos and Michelle Obama both attended what New Jersey institution? Princeton. Princeton. Number three, the phrase alma mater comes from the Latin meaning nurturing mother. What does alumnus mean in Latin? That means foster son. Foster son. And number four, the University of Bologna or Bologna, the oldest university in the world, was founded in 1088 in what country? Italy. Italy. Number five, what private research university in North Carolina was founded in 1838 in the town of Trinity and then moved its current location to Durham in 1892? That's Duke, Duke University. Number six there, the seven sisters are seven highly selective women's liberal arts colleges in the northeastern U.S. Which of these is the largest? The answer from your choices was Smith College, Smith College. And number eight, the uh, Rhodes Scholarship, sorry, number seven, the Rhodes Scholarship is an international postgraduate award for students to study at which famous university? That's the University of Oxford, Oxford. And number eight, over the course of several decades, what Maryland institution has led all U.S. universities in research expenditures? John Hopkins University, John Hopkins. And number nine, Morehouse College is a private historically black men's college in Atlanta, Georgia, which Hollywood actor was expelled for student activism. It was Sam Jackson, Samuel L. Jackson. And number 10, the NACTA Director's Cup is an award given to the American College or University with the most success in collegiate athletics between 94 and 2019. It was Stanford who won every year, Stanford. And your last question, number 11, the town where Massachusetts Institute of Technology is located shares its name with what British university, the second oldest in the English speaking world? That's Cambridge, Cambridge. And those are all your questions for today. Thank you guys so much for listening to the show. Hope you learned something. Hope you had some fun playing along with these in your car or on an airplane or on a road trip or on a treadmill or walking the dog or with a partner and all the different ways you can enjoy this show. I am behind on posting episodes, but it has been a very, very busy start to the holiday party season. So I do apologize. I will catch up eventually. And we do have a lot of spooky episodes on the back burner to post in October, hopefully sooner rather than later. We have one more thing for you called the fact of the day. The fact of today is possums do not actually play dead. Possums do not play dead. Thanks for listening. Thanks for telling a friend. We'll see you next time for more trivia with Buds. Cheers.